do I actually... Oh, well, I have to face this guy. Does Steven actually show up here, or is that only in Alpha, Sapphire, and Omega Ruby? I think it's on... I think it's in this game also, but... Oh, God. I really wish you hadn't turned around. Oh, and it has... Oh, that's not good at all. That's not good at all. That's not good at all. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Ruby Randomized FIFO Nuzlocke. My name is Etric, and we are here in episode 12, and we are about to face our father right here behind me. We are going to be taking him on, we are going to be beating him up, hopefully defeating him without any sort of issues. We've got ourselves a pretty good team. Grenade's a little under level, but everyone else is up in the high 20s. Hopefully his ace isn't higher than like level 31 and we should be able to take it down just fine, but if you're excited to see that, consider liking and subscribing. It really helps out the channel, and you'll be able to catch every single episode of not only this series, but every other series on this channel as it comes out. But I'm not going to beat around the bush at all. We're just going to take on our father. We're all healed up. We're all set. Monstars up front. We should be good to go. Hmm. So you did get four gym badges. Fine. As I promised, we will have a Pokemon battle. Ectric, I'm so happy that I can have a real battle with my own child. But a battle is a battle. I will do everything in my power as a gym leader to win. Ectric, you better give it your best shot, too. I will. Alright, let's do this thing. I am a little nervous about this battle because his levels are going to be high. Alright, 28, that's fine. Butterfree shouldn't be too difficult to take down. We'll start with strength. We outspeed, that's good. Two shot, perfect. This is fine, because... We outspeed it, and it's going to use and attack this n next turn. So, um, if we use our um, blue flute this turn, we'll wake up. It'll attack us. Oh, he's going to heal. Alright, so we're going to have to do that one more time. So, we're going to do strength. Unless we get a crit, in which case we're fine. There we go. Perfect call. Perfect timing. Thank you. Alright, so... One Mon down, two to go. Who's next? Jumpluff. That is... Uh, grass type. Um, we will be able to take this thing down with Flamethrower on Bobby pretty easily, I think. This thing isn't going to do any damage to us. It just might be... Um, annoying because it can heal itself. Oh, uh, and poison us, apparently. And it's faster. Wonderful. All right, Bobby, you're fine. You're fine, Bobby. You're fine. This should one-shot. Ah, uh, come on, Bobby. Also, I finally looked up how, uh, what level Bobby evolves at, and it's 38, so yikes. Oh, boy. All right, um, yeah, Bobby evolves at 38, um, and Splink evolves at 37, so I have a little ways to go before either of them become super duper useful. Unfortunately. But we got not, got rid of the uh, jump pluff. And now Venusaur. Ah. Um. I don't know. I want to keep Bobby in. I'm, I'm going to keep Bobby in. I'm going to use. Um, actually, I should have switched. Yeah, I definitely should have switched. I forgot the leech, leech seed was also on there. Alright, um, yeah, we're definitely gonna switch out. I should have switched before, but whatever. We'll go into Monstar. Venusaur shouldn't be able to do too much to us. It's not gonna use Leech Seed, because we were already leeched. Alright, Razor Leaf, that shouldn't do too much. Oh, that did a lot more than I thought it would. Uh, okay, well, at least we know we can live a crit. Um, we'll use an Energy Root to heal ourselves up to full. Alright. What's it going to use now? Razor Leaf again. I think what we need to do is just heal stall. Stop getting crits, you piece of crap! Um, you know what? Let's use a Soda Pop this time. We'll get... Ooh, that was dumb. That was real dumb. If we get crit again, we're going to lose Monstar. Okay, good. Perfect. Um, 
I should have just used the energy root. I don't know why I was being stingy. Because now I can't spend this turn healing up Bobby. Alright. So, it's going to hit. We're going to heal stall until another miss. Um, and then, once we... Uh... Okay, that works too, actually. Now we can spend this turn healing Bobby up to full. Um, we'll use... Um... The la the heal powder to heal up Bobby. Good. Um, razor leaf again. That's fine. I wish I had like a full restore, but unfortunately I'm gonna have to spend two turns healing up uh, Monstar. All right, so to pop again. I'm glad I have all these healing items. This is why I have these healing items. Okay, razor leaf. It missed again. Um, let's use. A soda pop on Bobby this turn. Good. Razor Leaf. Alright, now we just need to wait for one more miss. Because I'm not risking losing Monstar to a crit. Alright, good. Luckily, Razor Leaf has 95 accuracy, so it can miss. Otherwise, we'd just be heal stalling forever. Until we it ran out of PP, which would really be annoying. Alright. This is fine. Once it misses, we'll use the blue flute, and then, I guess, attack with Monstar? I probably should have just tried to attack with Monstar rather than healing up Bobby, because I don't want to switch in to Bobby for a Razor Leaf, even, even if it's going to be not very effective. Perfect. Alright, now time to use our blue fruit flute, our blue fruit, as I said, but did not mean... Okay. We're fine. We're fine. Okay. We're good. We're good. Um, I do not trust myself to one-shot this thing, so I'm just gonna heal stall until it misses again. Playing it safe, but... Ah, perfect. Okay. So, strength. This should two-shot, hopefully. Oh, come on. Alright, we're fine. So that put us to sleep. We can now use the blue flute to wake ourselves up again. Good. And then... Razor Leaf, that's fine. Um... I don't trust myself to not, to not get crit here. We haven't gotten a crit in a while. Ugh. Alright, we're fine. I, I hate this. I hate heal stalling. Heal stalling sucks, man. Alright, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Okay, Venusaur, could you miss again? Uh, I hate it when it does that, I hate it when it does that. Alright, energy root here. We're all set now. I am super glad I didn't go for the attack though, because <laughs> we got crit the ne next turn. Alright, strength. And, uh, come on, that's like 75 accuracy. Alright, we're fine. Okay, one more one more hit on this Venusaur should do the trick, so we'll just wait until it misses again. Or runs out of razor leaves. Oh my god, I forgot he'd have a hyper potion. Um You know what? Let's actually take this chance to switch into Bobby. I wanna I wanna try and use flamethrower on it, because that should two shot from here. Perfect, it missed. Flamethrower. Sweet scent? Interesting. That just lowers my evasiveness. It means it's gonna miss less likely, or it's less likely that it will, it'll miss, I guess. Perfect. That's a two shot. Sleep powder. <sighs> Stop it. All right, on, on the bright side, I don't think Razor Leaf is gonna do too much to us. So we just need to make sure it doesn't keep getting uh, sleep powders off. Alright, Razor Leaf, let's see how much this does to Bobby. Okay, that's fine. A crit from here... <sighs> crit would kill from here, I think. Yeah, that does 26, so 52. Yeah, I'd, I'd better heal. Better safe than sorry. We'll use a regular potion for this. Because it's probably going to try to put us to sleep again. Yep. Alright. <sighs> that's annoying. That's real annoying. Alright, um... 
blue flute. You know, actually, it's going to hit us. And then we can definitely get the attack off because it's going to try and put us to sleep again. So, flamethrower. <sighs> Darn it. Dude. All right. Now, unfortunately, what we have to do is we have to use a soda pop first turn, then sleep powder second turn. Or, not sleep powder, the blue flute. Sleep powder is what it used on us. Alright. That's fine. Um, we use the blue flute on Bobby. Please don't kill Bobby. That's all I ask. Don't crit. Don't crit. Uh, I don't like that. Alright. Um, we'll get ourselves a... Soda Pop, right? Yeah, Soda Pop's fine for Bobby. Good. Sl sleep Powder? Oh, wow, it's using Razor Leaf. Did it run out of Sleep Powders? Um, it's gonna try using Sleep Powder now. Miss! Miss! You piece of crap! Uh, stop putting me to sleep! Uh, this is annoying as hell. You know what? Actually, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to switch into Monstar. It's going to use Razor Leaf here. And then we outspeed it. So we should kill from here. Before it gets the Sleep Powder off. Alright. Strength. We outspeed. Just kill it. Perfect. Whew! Alright. That was definitely much harder than the last few battles have been. But we did it. And we got Grenade to grow a level, too. I... I can't. I can't believe it, Ectric. I lost to Ectric? But rules are rules. Here, take this. Here's a bunch of money. Go buy yourself something special. And also the balance badge. Balance badge. That, too. Thanks, Dad. With that badge, the defense of all your Pokémon will increase. Pokémon that know the HM Smooth Surf will be able to travel over water. This is my gift to you, Ectric. I'm sure you can use it correctly. Thanks. Hopefully it's something good like, uh, what it usually is. I think it's Dizzy Punch that it gives us. Oh, Facade? Well, I hope it's something better than Facade. Like Dizzy Punch. That'd be great. Give it to, uh, whatchamacallit, um, what's his name? Monstar. Oh, yes. While his parents came calling earlier, they said that they had something they wanted to give you, Electric. Alright, cool. Well, let's go check what that TM was. Um, it was Reflect. Kind of want to just sell that. Alright! We got ourselves a fifth badge now. We just need to go over a heel and then grab Surf from Wally's parents. Fun fact, actually. Um, I had originally planned on possibly using the Petalberg music as my intro music for the channel. Um, I ended up going with um, the music from How to Train Your Dragon because I figured... I figured that the music that I ended up using had a better, like, more succinct start and end, as opposed to this song. Like, there's there's no real end to this song because it's meant to loop over and over again, so I didn't really know how to, like, give it a, a quick end tag. Um, but it, yeah, I, I really in, uh, I really enjoyed this song. I almost used it for my uh, channel theme, so I, I am, this is one of my favorite songs. Hi there, Archer. Our Wally's become very healthy since he went over to Verdant Turf Town. We owe it all to you. When Wally left town, you helped him catch a Pokemon, right? I think that made Wally really happy. Actually, not just Wally. It made hit me, his father, happy too. Happy that he's got such a great friend as you. This isn't a bribe or anything, but I'd really like you to have this. We got ourselves Surf. <gasps> oh, that's perfect! Now we can give it to, uh, Splink! Let's, let's do that. Immediately. Splink needs to be able to learn Surf. We could also probably teach it to someone else. Um, definitely Splink. Uh, does anyone else... Do we want to give it to anyone else? Um, let's get rid of Water Gun for this. Now we've got a really strong Water-type move. Perfect. And... Do I want to give it to anyone else? Probably not, right? It's, it's like a bit of a stretch to give it to anyone else, so... Also, we can get ourselves an encounter in this town. There we go! We got ourselves a Ponyta encounter in the middle of the water. Um, let me just try chucking a Great Ball over here. 
All right, this is cool. I'm glad that we can hopefully get ourselves a, an encounter, a Ponyta. Ponyta would be good to have on the team. Um, obviously, we can't add it to the team. Uh, I will forever be explaining that, I suppose, in these types of challenges, but we will be uh, putting it in the box. Come on, just catch it. All right, I'm just gonna speed up. I don't feel like we. There we go. We got ourselves a Ponyta. All right, Ponyta is a very is very weak at birth. It can barely stand up. This Pokemon becomes stronger by stumbling and falling to keep up with its, its parent. Um, let's see. It stumbles and keeps up with its parent. Um, it sounds like a, a little like duckling almost. Um, I don't know. What what is a good name for this? Uh, stumble. Uh, stumble stilt skin, um, stilts, uh, stilt, how about stilt, alright, there we go, oh, I probably should have gone with rumple, oh well, that would have been a good name too, ooh, sacred ash, this, now, I think in another gen, uh, it might have been gen 5, we got this item, and we weren't sure whether this was a revive or could be used as a full restore I don't know um, it's probably just a revive it's probably like a, a, a full revive or like a max revive but for all of our Pokemon not just one so really not that useful but it's okay let's go heal real quick and now the next place we need to go is east of Mauville we need to go and head up towards um, the Weather Institute. So let's go do that now. Get ourselves over to Oldale, Oldale, and then east of Oldale, we can surf across and get over towards Mauville again. Perfect. Uh, are there any trainers in here? No. I thought there were swimmer trainers. Maybe that's only an emerald. Basically, any time I get, I get something wrong about this game, I'm gonna assume it's because it was an emerald and not in this game. Just warning you. Alright, let's go bike up bicycle road, or cycling road, and we will then head east of Mauville and surf. We already got the Route 118 encounter, so we cannot get any encounter in that route, but move out of the... Why? Why do you insist on running right in front of me every time? You're a jerk, you little... Piece of crap bicyclist. Uh, whatever. Anyway, we already got ourselves the encounter in... Oh! I forgot! We can get ourselves an encounter in New, New Mallville or Old Mallville or whatever it's called. Electric, you look like you have a lot of zip. That's a good thing, wah ha ha Fine, I've decided. I need a favor, Electric. Mallville City has an underground sector called New Mallville. Electric, I'd like you to go there and switch off the generator. The generator has been running a bit haywire. It's getting unsafe. Here, this is the key to getting to the new Mauville. All right, let's go get ourselves that encounter there also. Go over there, and then we just have to surf, and we can get a bunch of items. We can get ourselves some encounters. Um, I'm going to consider the static encounters different than the wild encounters there, but I'm only going to allow myself to get one static encounter, the first one. Unless it's dupes, in which case I'll go for another one, but um, that is the plan. Do I get... Is there an item here? Oh, this is a, a place where I could get a secret base. That's what it is. All right, so head over here and in here. So let's put um, Bobby up front. Oops. Switch Bobby up front. Good. And now let's use the key. All right, new area, fun stuff. Good. Okay, what do we got? Do 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 do. Ooh, a Fero. That's cool. All right, so it's got Drought, so we probably shouldn't use Flamethrower, otherwise it might kill it by accident. <sighs> All right, so that could do up to 45 damage plus a crit, so. Definitely want to be careful and switch Bobby out from here. Um, let's put in Grenade. Because I think Grenade will be able to handle this better than uh, Yama would. 
fly. Alright, Leer, that's fine. Alright, now it's asleep. We can use Sonic Boom. Two, uh, three times? We could probably use it three times, right? Yeah, we could probably do it. use it one more time, right? What? Can we use it? There we go. Now it woke up. Leer again. Now, let's go into Splink, and we'll use Eon. Put it to sleep again. And now, we'll use Eon one more time. Good. Alright, now it's asleep again, and we can use... Let's use a regular Pokeball first. I want to try and save my Great Balls if, necessa uh, if they're necessary for something stronger than a Fero. Perfect. Alright, we got ourselves the Fero. What are we going to name this thing? Let's see. Um, it's the Beak Pokemon. <laughs> well, that's fun. Um, Beaker. Fero is recognized by its long neck and elongated beak. They are conveniently shaped for catching prey in soil or water. It definitely moves its long and skinny beak to pluck prey. Um... The name of the, the, the Muppet with the, like, tuft of red hair is called Beaker, right? Let's name it after that, Beaker. Alright, cool. Beaker the Fero. Now we can use a Repel and only encounter the uh, random electrodes in here. Except they're going to be randomized. Um, actually, are there? Oops. Wrong button. There we go. Don't press the button this time. Good. Uh, there definitely are. That was that definitely could have been an an encounter. Um, let's grab this item real quick. A macho brace. We can sell that. That's the way back. Head up here. Grab this. Oh, there's the encounter. Okay. What do we got? Ooh, a Metatite. These can be pretty good. Alright, so... Yawn. Um... Oh, it protects itself... It protects itself from Yawn also? Why? Stop that. Alright, Hidden Power. That's fine. It'll need an 18 damage. Crit will kill it from... Kill Bobby from here, though, so we should definitely switch into... Uh, grenade. Good. Alright, what does it got? Detect again? Ha ha ha, idiot. Alright, now it's asleep. Sonic Boom. Alright, we can do one more, and then... Yeah, okay, now we, we start chucking balls. One. Two. Three. Perfect. Alright, we got ourselves the Metatite. First ball. Hooray! Okay, what are we gonna name it? So, meditate tight undertakes rigorous mental training deep in the mountains. However, whenever it meditates, this Pokemon always loses its concentration and focus. As a result, its training never ends. <laughs> so, it never stops training, uh, but it can't focus. Um, Alright, so, who's someone that can never stop training? One Punch Man. What's His name is Saitama, right? Um, <laughs> so... Sight. <laughs> I know what I'm gonna do. Sight. Uh, we need to do. Sight. Wait. Wait. What? <laughs> All right. Yeah. Sight. Wait. Because he gets distracted in the middle of saying his name, and no longer can know his name, and so that's his name. Sight. Wait. All right. We'll use a Super Repel, perfect. And open up that door. Head up here. Ah! Ooh, th I'm glad I did not get this. Um, let's use a Super... Or a... Whatchamacallit? Let's use a Soda Pop to heal up Bobby. And then we'll use Flamethrower on this thing. Because I don't think we're going to be able to uh, run away from this thing. It's probably faster than us. Take down, that's fine. Alright. Goodbye, Matang. Good. 
We'll also use another soda pop outside of battle so we don't have to keep healing him and wasting turns. All right, good. Now let's go back down to the super repels so that when the uh, that one runs out, we'll be able to get ourselves re-repelled without having to move around. Okay, grab this. Son of a gun. You know what? Run away. Thank you. All right, max ether. That's a good item to have. Um, we definitely need to press this button down. And then... Perfect. We turned off the generator. Generator appears to have stopped. Perfect. And we got an energy root. Another healing item. Beautiful. All right. So now we got to go down here. Head over this way again. Through this way. Um, let's repel again. Perfect. Actually, here's what we can do. Escape rope. We don't even have to worry about that. Perfect. All right. So we got ourselves two more encounters. We got our, we turned off the uh, generator, and now we're going to get ourselves an, a TM from Watson. And then we can go on towards the east of Mauville. All right, what do we got? Wahaha! I knew it, Tetrick. I knew I'd make the right choice asking you. This is my thanks. A DM containing Thunderbolt. Go on, you've earned it. I wish it actually was Thunderbolt. That'd be perfect, but... Alas, it's randomized. Wahaha! It pleases me to no end to see your young, the young step up and take charge. That's, that, that's nice. All right, let's see what we actually got. Ooh, sand attack. That's actually not a bad mo move anyway. It's not my favorite that I could have gotten, but, you know, these things happen. All right, let's go east and take on some more of this challenge. Now, I can't remember. Um, do I actually... Oh, well, I have to face this guy. Does Steven actually show up here, or is that only in Alpha, Sapphire, and Omega Ruby? I think it's, on... I think it's in this game also, but... Oh, God. I really wish you hadn't turned around. Oh, and it has... Oh, that's not good at all. That's not good at all. That's not good at all. All right. Monstar. Um, I think it, it just set up a uh, rain. Um, why? Yeah, it did. Crap. All right. Um, let's switch. Let's actually switch into Grenade. Okay, what's it using? Whirlwind again? Um, you know what? If it's just going to keep using Whirlwind, then let's just use Strength on it. God, of course, now you use Gust, you piece of crap. Alright, let's run away. Or, or switch into another Mon. Oh god. Alright, um, yeah, definitely switch into someone else. Um, I trust Monstar more than Grenade, actually. Because we're higher level than this Lugia. Gust again, that's fine. Alright, that only did 12 damage. It doesn't seem to have any water-type moves. Also, it's not Stab, anyway, so... It's fine. Good. Gust. Alright, keep using Gust all you want. We can live a, a crit of that, so we should be able to kill... Oh, we got the crit. Perfect. Goodbye, Lugia. Whew. Scary stuff. Um, who's next? Wurmple. That's much easier to kill. Let's go with... Let's give Fly some experience. We haven't given Fly anything to do in a while. Really wish that um, we uh, had a flying move on Fly. But it might it seems that we're gonna have to wait until uh, after the sixth gym to be able to get him any sort of stab. Alright, that's fine. Quick attack. One more. Perfect. Alright. Down goes this fisherman. That's what you get for being a jerk and using a Lugia on me. Oh there he is. I knew it. Hi! You're that trainer I met in Duford. Yes. Oh, okay, you're Ectric. I'll remember it. Ectric, in this vast world, there are many kinds of Pokémon. They come in many types. Do you raise different types, or do you raise only Pokémon of a certain type? What do you think of... What do you think as a trainer? Sorry, it's not my place to ask, is it? Well, anyway, I hope to see you again soon. Sh sure, yeah. Alright, let's grab grab these berries. Are they block berries? They're citrus berries. Oh, those are actually very useful. I should put those on my mons in... in significant battles. Alright. Good. Now, 
This is Route 118 still, so we don't get an encounter here. Does he turn left? Can you turn back? Can you turn back? Thank you. Alright, um... We got rid of the repel. This is Route 119. Okay, let's end off this episode with an encounter, and then we will call it an episode, and in the next one we will get ourselves to the Weather Institute. Alright, what do we got? Ooh, Dratini- or Dragonair. Dratini's the baby one. Alright, so yawn. Twister shouldn't do too much to us, right? Alright, good. Even if he uses Dragon Rage here, it won't kill. So now, I think Flamethrower should be okay. It resists fire, so... We should be fine. Oh yeah, it did nothing. And now... Um, let's switch into... Um, grenade for this, and use Sonic Boom, and one more Sonic Boom. Perfect. Oh god. Alright, we're fine. Um, was not thinking about Dragon Rage there. Let's switch into Splink this time, and use Yawn again. Alright, Dragon Rage. We can live another one of those, honestly, so. Good. And then, let's just heal up this turn with a Sodi Pop good. Probably gonna use Dragon Rage again. Yep, that's fine. Now it's asleep. Let's chuck some balls. Regular Pokeball first. One, two, three. Perfect. We got the Dragonair. Route 119 encounter, successful. When's the last time we failed an encounter? Was it really the first one? I feel like I've gotten every single encounter except for the first one, which is ridiculous. Alright, Dragonair. Uh, female... It's an angry dragon. We could name this Toothless. Um, or Astrid. Um, actually, we did have a dragon Dragonite named Astrid before, so let's name it Astrid. Do a callback. Astrid. Perfect. There we go. Astrid. Alright, so with that, I think we will call it an episode here. In the next one, we'll continue onward down towards... Uh, or up towards the Weather Institute, and we will then go take on the 6th gym. But for now, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I had a lot of fun with it. And if you did, consider liking and subscribing. It really helps out the channel, and you'll be able to catch every single episode of not only this series, but every other series on the channel as they come out. But regardless, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. Have a great day.